So I'm Renee Sides. I'm the chairman of the Cordova Economic and Industrial Development Authority, and we're out at the Cordova Fourth of July bash on July 3rd. Uh, this is our second festival this year, and we've got two more uh, for 20, uh, 2021. We've got a uh, Harvest Fest festival on October the 16th, and then we've got our uh, Christmas market on December the 4th. So one of the things that we're trying to do is promote Cordova as a destination community. Uh, we've got the river that is absolutely gorgeous, and we've adopted a new motto that's that Cordova, a majestic, majestic place to call home. Uh, CETA has recently constructed through funds from the Walker Area Foundation a pavilion that's going to be for the use of all the, the residents in Cordova, and we're in the process of setting up a farmer's market there. So I just invite everybody out, get a fresh look at Cordova because lots of great things are happening. I'm Jeremy Pate, Mayor of the City of Cordova. Uh, we are thankful for the uh, Industrial Development Authority for the things that they've done to help create this events committee and do the things necessary to bring these events to come to pass here in the city. Uh, we're thankful for all the volunteers that they put together to, uh, to have these events, to be able to, uh, to get them all together and gather everybody together and the people that it brings in in the hopes that, you know, they'll see what they like and, and, and want to either move here or invest here. Um, uh, we're thankful for our police and fire departments who help us keep everybody safe. Uh, during these times, uh, we're thankful for Cordova First Baptist Church for putting on the fireworks tonight for the, uh, they do every year and the things that they do to volunteer to help the city.